Hello, um, welcome to Serenity Garden and Orchids. It's Vanessa, and I bring you greetings from the great state of Pennsylvania. And today I will be showing you all of the plants that I have left. And most of you know that I went through a lot in 2022. I lost two of my grandchildren. So the picture there is a picture of my children and their children. And unfortunately, one of my grandchildren one of my grandsons was murdered in July, and I lost one of my granddaughters in October. Never let grief take you over, guys. It tried to take me over, and I was gone for quite a bit, but I'm back, knowing that God loves me, and I'm finding love in the things that I used to do again. Not that I don't miss them, I will forever miss them, but I'm letting God take control of my life, bring me back, and no, I know that it's gonna be okay. So guys, I'm asking you to just let love lead the way. And it's that time of year, it's Valentine's, and just find love, whatever you love, and I'm telling you, it will destroy the grief. Give God praise and find those things that you love the most, whether it's plants, butterflies, whatever it is, find it and hold on to it tight, and you're going to make it through. Because if I can make it losing two, I know you can make it all set. So here's my fiddle leaf figs. And guys, I have a lot of, as I said, I wasn't taking care of my plants. I was trying to breathe, guys. And I found that pretty hard to do after losing two grandbabies. But as I said, slowly but surely, I'm coming back at Val's. A lot of them don't look as good as they did, but they'll be okay. I'll just take you around. And you'll be with me as I clean some of this stuff up that needs to go. I'm gonna be working on these plants. We'll do it together, guys. Look. It's a different back here. That's a dendrobium. And look, I'm not playing when I said I lost a lot of plants, just dead things, just dead. I got to get rid of them. And as I said, we're going to do this thing together, guys. I'm back. The fell. Got a couple of fowls still hanging in there. Another dead thing. Some plants. Spider. And guys, you remember that used to be huge? It's still here. I'm glad of that. Same thing here. A lot of my plants are struggling. But it's been a hard journey, and I'm back. That's some kind of orchid, an epidendrum. It's doing okay. One moment, please. Look at the pretty weeds in that. That's a cat leah, some kind of cat leah, BLC Mary's Glory. So it's pretty. It has beautiful um, roots. Look at the roots on that bad boy. I think she's going to be okay. Here's something over here. Not sure it's gonna make it. We shall see. And more dead things, unfortunately. So okay guys, there's more fails. That's some kind of dendrobium. And here's another one. Gorgeous. And that's just a snake plant. So while my daughter's at work, I am now taking care of Astro. Astro Diggy. Astro. Oh, he's so busy. Astro, look up so the people can see you. Say hi. Astro Diggy. There he is. There he is. There's Astro Diggy. Astro. There he is. Oh. Yes. He say hello to y'all. So if you guys can see, my collection is nothing like it used to be. But I have a few that just hang, hang in there. They just don't want to die. A few cat leas. There's a huge one. It's another different bakia and there's another pineapple down there. It hasn't been easy for them. I don't know how they made it because I'm telling you, neglect was my middle name. You guys probably remember my granddaughter, Neve, from some of my unboxings from Camilla Orchids. Um, she used to help me all the time. She's the one who was saying, who needs 200 plants? <laughs> Here's some of my plants again. 
the ZV up there. Okay. Um, oh, there's an orchid. I don't know what kind of orchid it is, but it's um one of them ones that got the big tuber thing down the bottom. Oncidium. Oncidium. I don't know what kind it is, but it gets beautiful orange flowers. And then that's something I have in the window. Um, I'm forgetting the name is eluding me right now, but you guys, if you know plants, you know what that is. Here's one of my big spiders up there. Okay, one moment. Okay, guys, so as you can see, a lot of pots are empty. His fell, mother fell, and I think this splash, uh, Hoya Pubicanic Splash or something, it's called. It's the only Hoya I got left, so you guys know I lost a lot of plants. Um, a few more items. Snake plant up there. You guys believe it all the plants I had they're all gone but as I said I'm back and I'll be getting my collection going again oh I lied here's another Hoya I do have one more um I think that's some kind of crimson queen I believe it's beautiful okay one moment have this one long veranda left, and I think she's going to be okay. See the beautiful root growing from her, so I think she'll make it. So, guys, I think I'm going to end here. This is love is patient, is kind. Love does not envy and does not boast. It's not easily angered. It always protects, always trusts, always hopes, and always perseveres. Love never fails. If you're grieving, hold on to that fact. Love never fails. Be kind to yourself. Be good to yourself. Know that it's okay. Everything's going to be all right in time. Much love to you. And as I always say, you're blessed to be a blessing. Bye guys.